Hey, how's it going, guys? And welcome back to another episode of our Tokyo Ghoul Dark War series. And today, I have been doing a lot of different things over the past two weeks in this game. Uh, we did have a live stream as well the other day, which if you did miss, that was over on Twitch.tv. Um, I will have all my links and everything in the description, as always, if you want to go and follow me over there. But we did do a Tokyo Ghoul Dark War stream the other day. And a lot of that content will actually be shown in the next episode. If there is any content that I need to show in this episode, I will insert it into the video. But yes, so a few things. We'll go in chronological order. Um, sometime early last week, I didn't get around to making a video, unfortunately, which otherwise I would have already have done this. Um, I did, in fact, get myself... Nope. I have got you, but it's not you I'm looking for. I got myself from the VIP diamond draw. I did, had four cards. I did talk about this on stream. I got four of the VIP cards. The first one was an SR character. I got some shards for that. The second one was full, like the full complete half Kakuja Yamori. I pulled that. The third one was some Toka Rabbit shards. And then the fourth one was half Kakuja again. So I ended up, as you can see, I've got some um, some thing is still left over here. Um, he is four star, as you can see from you can't see it under the webcam, but as you can see from the star upgrades, he is four star. I use the shards and his unlock to get him up to four star. So that's very nice. Once I get him to five star, I'm probably gonna end up replacing Hinami with him, potentially. Because their passives basically do the same thing. All team crit rate is increased. And they gain... Well, hit Yumori and his allies will gain HP to damage dealt. Obviously, he's a DPS character. So, he's going to deal more damage than Hinami does. So, he's obviously going to heal more. Um, so, yes. Both him and Hinami do the same thing. Um, so, we're going to have a play around with him today. Um, I've got some other things that I will maybe talk about in this episode. Maybe not. I don't know. I might save that for another episode. And then I might be able to have two or three episodes out this week. To make up for the fact that I've not had one for two weeks, unfortunately. Um, but yes. Half Kuji Yumori. We got the bad boy himself. Which means I do... Um, I've got all his bonds. I've got every single character in the game... That I have up to purple quality. Um, there is another character here that I isn't purple quality. Because again I will go over that in another video here soon. And we'll have a look at Yoshimura Owl. But every character is now of purple quality. So I don't have to waste anything leveling those characters up now. Um, I've gone through about 10,000 level ups. Um, what they called? Cells. Evolution cells. I've gone through about 10,000 of those. Just trying to get everything up to where I want it. I've got Kaya Black Dog, um, Hinami, and also my trusty guy, Younger Rima over here. I've got these up to purple plus five quality, which means once I hit level 80, I think I'm level 75 at the moment. Once I hit level 80, I'm going to be able to get myself some gold legendary characters, which is going to be very, very nice. They do get about 6,000 Six thousand, yeah, we got about six thousand increase. That's no five thousand one hundred. We get that. Oh, it's six hundred, five thousand five hundred. Yeah, you got. We got a decent amount of HP. Um, his attack stat goes up quite a lot. It's gonna be wild once we. I think there's only one person on the server at the moment. Let me see. Yeah, there's only lightning on my server who is above the threshold. Um, Jules and Getsugra aren't too far behind. Getting XP is so difficult in this game. Um, I'm not far off level 76, actually. Um, yeah, I wish I could say, let's get a level a day, but it's just so, 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 so difficult. Um, I sit every day and I go through and complete every one of these quests just so I get the maximum XP from it. It's a tough one. It's a tough one. But anyways, let us go into a... Let's do... Let's do this. Let me grab myself half Kakuja. And let's have a look at him a little bit. 
Let's have a look at him a bit, a little bit. So, you've got his autos, which are pretty snazzy. Uh, we've got his first, which deals damage and gives you a shield. You've got his second, which I was about what to show you, but you? then... You're what brings me. You're what brings me. Tsukiyama, he's going to appear. So, my second, which I want to use. There's his second. So it's a one and a slam. Um, we've got his third, which I'm going to use against these boxes here. So, so it's a two-hit combo. Let's see. Have I got all? I've got all the boxes. That's pretty cool. So that's that and a shield. So he does do a decent amount of damage, and obviously he's healing. He's healing off himself here and Hinami. But really, you only need Hinami on one team. So, it's got some pretty nice abilities. They're not as flashy. He is an older SSR now, so... They're not as flashy as some of the new SSRs, but... That is pretty cool. That is pretty cool for our boy over here. That's going to give us... Some nice juicy stuff. It's up to 32 now. I've actually not looked at the rank for this. Where I'm sixth on here. I bet I can get a lot higher than that. I can get a lot higher than that. I could probably be fifth. For sure. Just based off this page alone. But. That's a pretty nice thing. Now I have noticed as well. Uh, we'll go in and try and do some ghoul expulsion in a moment. Um, in fact we might not do it this video. It might go into the next video. Because I'm going to try and record two of these or maybe even three of these since we have got three ssr characters to cover um but yeah we've got a new festival the festival that was going on last week again i will, I will talk about that in the next video um but the festival we did last week we actually completed which was very very nice thumbs up to us um and that was for an ssr character which is why we've got so many to show off um, this one is chest three, and it's Wounded Konaki, Half Kakuja Konaki, Yoshimura Owl, and Suki Yama Gourmet. Now, my issue here is, is if I get this, I'd love to use the shards on an SSR character in there. Uh, either the Half Kakuja Konaki or the Wounded Konaki. I'd love to put the shards into that. The internal struggle I have right now is, I don't actually have Gourmet for obvious reasons. He's not the best. He's probably one of the worst, if not the worst, SSR character. Can I... My internal struggle is, can I... Do I want to put all those? I mean, I guess out of the four, it's not too bad. But for completion's sake and for having the character... I feel like I need to get it and potentially do a video on him. Is he as bad as people say he is? I think we'll probably do that video. So I might, if we com complete this, we might do a gourmet. Looks like somebody's online. Oh, dealings on. So it's exactly the same as the last few weeks of being the festival. Complete it, get some shards, all of that good stuff. That's pretty much what is going on in that. Uh, we did get a draw, so let's do the draw. Oh, we got some SSRs from the... Uh, from the not the blue draw. Mm. So we've got 12. Uh, Kur Kurowaya Arata. I can never say his name properly. Oh, we got a hero in the next luxury. We've got some shards here, which is Naki. We're not far off getting him to five star, so that's always pretty nice. Two more rolls. Two more rolls, and we can see what we can get. The chances of SSR are being increased. So that is pretty, pretty nice. Um, yeah, I just wanted to do a little video here. You know, obviously show that we have got ourselves half Kakuji Yamori. Um, I don't really want to put him into Ghoul Explosion because if he was five star, yes, I would definitely switch out Hinami and we could go into Ghoul Explosion and try it out. My issue is I don't have a lot of gems to do my Ghoul Explosion today. So I want to try and save the turns that I have for next video which you will see why. But that's going to be it for today's video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. Hopefully 
hopefully it was a you know a little bit interesting i'm um, apologies i can't i'm trying to make bits of content for here and there because i am doing the stream thing at the moment and it's taken me a lot longer to produce content on the side which is a little bit unfortunate but anyways with having three videos that means you get three chances to win some codes so on screen now there will be two different codes if you've already well in fact there might be three different codes now because i've got a new batch of codes so the third code is going to be a brand new batch of codes um obviously if you've already had a code win before um then I'm putting them in the same order every time. So the first code is the first batch. The second code is the second batch. And the third code is going to be the new batch. If you've already run a code out of any of these before, it will tell you you have already redeemed a code because it's from the same batch of codes, if you understand what I'm saying. So it won't actually let you win the codes if you've won the code from that batch. Or you've got it from somebody else before. No, I don't think it does it for somebody else. I think it's just one... I feel like it's one per batch that we get as a creator. I don't know. But yeah, if you've won the code before, you're probably not going to be able to do it again. The new batch, of the, which is going to be the third code, if you want to try that one out, then that is the one which is going to be the one that you can win. But that is going to be it for me today. I will see you again in a few days' time for another Tokyo Gold Art War video. Have a wonderful safe day, and I will see you guys all then. Bye for now.